All right, uh, one of my favorite escapes uh, for straight leg lock is, before I even go for the escape, I make sure I make a boot. My, I point my toes towards me so that I buy myself some time before the break even happens. If my left leg's caught, I like to post with my left hand. I use my right hand to pin the leg that's controlling me. As I pin this leg, I put all my weight on my left arm and I hop over. Once I clear my butt, I start scooting down at the same time I control the knee so that he does not go over. I keep coming down, keep coming down. Then I'll bring this leg and I'll push. And I'll free my leg from being broken. My second favorite uh, defense to the straight leg lock is obviously same thing. Make a boot. Buy yourself some time. Same time, control the arm. Okay, so I pull him in. Left hand on left arm. Right hand, I pull this knee out. Okay. It's not going to be easy, but you got to fight for this. So as I pull this knee up, I screw out a little bit and I bring this thing over. Then I push it again. Uh, my, my next uh, favorite defense of the straight leg lock is obviously make a boot so that you buy yourself some time. Left hand controls the left arm over here. So if I keep him over here, he can't quite arch his back fully. Uh, uh, I'll be able to control him a little bit, okay? Now, with my right hand, I open the knee up a little bit so that I can bring this leg over. Uh, I have a split second. As I open, I need to keep this way and step through and come up. Into mount. Once I'm into mount, he could keep holding off my leg. There's no way for him to finish because his legs are not in action anymore. So a proper way of making the boot and protecting your leg is, you can't, you can't take your time over here. You gotta be a little bit aggressive, so you have to kick sometimes okay so when you kick that that buys you the distance for you to make the boot because imagine he's going to be laying back on it if you just make a boot chances are you're not going to be able to break his back down because he's falling backwards so make sure you kick so you can make a boot over there even if you readjust right i'm always turning i'm always turning my leg i'm trying to give him as many angles on the leg so that he's not able to securely lock my leg up during this time when he's trying to readjust is when it's my time to escape. Does that make sense? So if I, if I buy myself time over here, I can always, if I could just slightly turn my heel out, I can usually pull my leg down. 